Hello, welcome to Joy Academy. Today I'll be showing you a tip you can use for your CPT 111 exams, A exams, that will make you score a better grade and make you faster, answer questions faster. So in case you are given a binary to convert to a decimal, you can do it within 10 seconds or converting a decimal to a binary or multiplying between binaries. You can do it within split seconds. So stay tuned to this video to learn this trick. So the first thing you need to know is that on your calculator, you have a decimal and a binary option. Usually, it is it is the decimal that is usually clicked. That's why when you do 56 plus 56, it gives you 112. But to do this, you have to perform a binary operation. Maybe you have 1100 times 1011. You first of all change it to a binary. So you go to the top of your calculator and click binary. It will be at the side of decimal. You click BIN. So once you click it, you can go ahead with your solving with your calculation. So I was trying to get the prototype of e exams calculator, but I was unable to do so. So that's why I'm, I'm with this calculator. So once you understand the basics, you'll be able to apply it to your e exams. So let's say for me to take it to binary, I'll have to click on this. So now it's on binary. So once I've clicked on binary, I will do my operation. Let's say I have 11001 plus 100110. I was asked to add this up. And my answer will come naturally like this. So as fast as possible, I've just solved a question like this in less than five seconds. Instead of me converting the binary to a decimal, then adding up the decimal, then converting the decimal back to a binary. I've just solved it and within five seconds I've gotten my answer. And suppose we are asked to convert a a binary a binary to a decimal. What we'll do, let's say we have this binary one zero zero one zero one one and we're asked to convert it to a decimal. So we'll click on binary, write our 1001011, and write equal to, it gives us this as the answer. Then we we'll go and click on decimal. Once you click on decimal, it changes to the decimal form of that binary. So no need of, of solving, converting the this binary to a decimal. Just with this, with this simple trick, you can do it within split seconds. And the other way around, if we are asked to convert a decimal to a binary you click on decimal yes it's on decimal here and then you type your decimal let's say 218 so equal to your answer it gives you 218 so the next thing to do to convert to a binary you press this binary yes this binary here once you click on it it gives you the value of 218 in its binary form so i i know you learned something new in this video and a lot your a lot of your friends need to see this before the exams a lot of your course mates needs to watch this video before exam so do well to share to them and subscribe to this channel for more tutorials more videos will be coming like this that will help you out stay tuned to joe academy thanks for watching